Okay, hello dear friends, good evening, such a beautiful, beautiful Saturday evening. So here I will show you the, the gahamel I made. This is a chocolate gahamel. Can you see it? And this one is, uh, um, is coffee gahamel. And relatively, I, I like uh, chocolate, uh, I, I like coffee one more than the chocolate maybe because i i am not uh, the um, very chocolatey person i am not a fan a big huge fan of chocolate chocolate and um, and also um not only from its own texture but also from the 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 yogurt i made you can see it so this is caramel this is a caramel, um, uh, coffee caramel uh, yogurt. And this one is a chocolate caramel yo yogurt. And it has a, a layer of this chocolate uh, floating to the top, which is um, not the most uh, prettiest color. See the texture, it looks uh, marbled and um, it's quite interesting actually. Quite interesting, and this one, the caramel, is relatively well. It's also kind of marbled, but uh, the taste is much, uh, much more uh, satisfying for in 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 my to my taste. Okay, now we will. I make sure I use this <laughs> beautiful handkerchief i used to usually use it as my um, scarf and look at the design there is design it's so pretty so i make sure i do not uh, damage my scarf the spoon is clean this spoon is clean this fork uh, the knife is clean uh, yes it is clean some fabric a little residue Okay, now we will take a look at this. Can I open it? It's already sealed. This one already sealed. Let me try. Yes. Did you hear the sound? The chocolate caramel. Okay, now the <clears throat> this one is uh, coffee caramel. Okay, oh, it's more runny. I feel a little bit more runny for this uh, coffee caramel. And we try to spoon it a little bit. This one for chocolate. See, this is the texture of chocolate. And now we see the texture of, uh, oh, oh, don't fall down. Now we see the texture of uh, coffee. It's more runny, maybe because I put a little bit more water, but uh, anyway, this seems a bit more runny and we taste the flavor of it. This much should be sufficient for the testing. This one is chocolate. <clears throat> I need to wait a little bit in between to clean my palette just by time a little bit. It's a beautiful, um, it was a beautiful um, chocolate uh, 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 coffee caramel, and this one is chocolate. Hmm, 
It's very good. Very, very good. It starts very good, and then it ends up with this very chocolatey um, taste. And um, chocolate taste, I don't know, I'm not the biggest fan of chocolate, so um, I do not feel, I, I feel it's quite strong or quite um, um, not pure enough. It's already have this uh, truffles flavor and, uh, and sweet from the chocolate. Maybe if I put cocoa powder will be better, but uh, just this chocolate from already manufactured and uh, achieved chocolate, it's not the, the very, very best. So if I rate these two, this is a winner. I cannot rate um, from 0 to 10 how many, but this one, comparatively, this one is the winner. I like it very much. Okay, now this program, we are going to stir the... the um, the yogurt so you can see how it how it will look like this is a little bit too too much I will take out a spoonful okay wait me one moment maybe I will use um, something half okay Okay, so because there is a little bit too much difficult for me to stir, so I will take out some of this uh, um, yogurt. So this one is easy to, to stir. This one is gahamel. So you see when you start to, uh, to go to touch the bottom because gahamel, it absorb a lot of uh, the moisture from the from the yogurt, uh, it uh, absorb a lot of uh, uh, water from the from the yogurt, so make it. So that is it, and this one is chocolate. You can see on top is a layer of chocolate. I put half out. They are about the same quantity, aren't they? Okay. Now I start to stir it. It should be the same thing that water comes out, but not so much water because uh, chocolate will... I like to, to, to eat this stirred yogurt. And um, it is quite uh, annoying the sound when you do it at uh, your workplace, right? You stir, stir, stir. It looks very. It it sounds very, very gross. What do we say? It's uh, grossier or just not a very good sound. So especially if you use a metal spoon. So I use plastic spoon. And this is the plastic spoon we we gathered from uh, uh, going to to some ice cream shop. They have this pretty plastic spoon. One time to throw away. I do not want to throw it away, so I kept it. So this is the the chocolate. Uh, Yogurt, it's a smooth as uh, they are the same smoothness. Eventually, now we will try distinguish the difference in flavor. Okay, we will start with chocolate. Okay, because they are. The last one I end up with chocolate, so my um, my tongue still have this chocolate flavor left over. One moment. It is good. 
and it is chocolatey. But comparing with the comparing with the market sold chocolate yogurt, it's not as sweet. Chocolate needs to be sweet, very sweet, very fat to make it good. So um, I am not doing as sweet as fat. So it is not uh, as pleasant as what you buy in you bought what you buy in in bakery store because bakery store they they want to sell things. They their intention is. You spend money to buy from them. Their intention is not your health, not uh, not your your well being. It's about their their money well being, right? That is the um, uh, chocolate, and this one we will try the yogurt. The 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 the. the. This one is. Uh, Coffee. I feel the coffee one has more character, or <clears throat> um, has a better character. I just personally feel. And from now on, I am thinking, <clears throat> why do we make caramel with salt? Because everything needs contrast. If you see Van Gogh's painting, he, he signed his name with red color on a green background, on a dark background, because of this complementary color brings out, brings out the intensity of, uh, of something he wants to emphasize. He wanted to emphasize. So by you, you can see this contrast. Let's just do this. And uh, <clears throat> in contrast to this orange, this red does not show that much red. But in contrast with this green, the red is very loud, right? So you need something to contrast it. Salt, salty and sweet is contrast, is uh, contradiction and brings to the best of this contradiction. Uh, so this is caramel, why it is uh, 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 sea salt caramel works very well. And uh, coffee is bitter, so coffee can bring out the best of, uh, of the sweetness. And chocolate, it just does not have that much character. And I'm thinking if we can we may be able to put something uh sour lemon citric uh, uh, acidity such as uh, uh, lemon but lemon itself is sweet is acidity and sugar is acidity so it does not have that much contrast so this is why anyway i'm talking too much uh coffee caramel a great success. I enjoy it very much. And this spoon, don't worry, I will use use it to make yogurt. Oh, oh, oh don't fall down. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, this one is... I can just wash it with... After some time, it will be washed. And this... I will use my lung to my tongue <laughs> to, to wash it. Bon appetito, enjoy. I love you, I really do. Do 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 do. Your choice.